It's your boy Thoroughbred Gaming. I'm back with another video today. Tonight, whatever. We will be playing Silent Hill. The short message. <clears throat> you know, I'm I'm kind of exploring my horror game spectrum, as you guys know. <clears throat> I got Choo Choo Charles Part 3 from him, but you know, we had to dive into something else real quick. Um, this just came out. We finna get into it. We finna see what it's about. You know what I mean? You know I gotta see what's shaking when a new horror game come out. <clears throat> but I appreciate y'all, man. And we finna get right back into this video. I've been going crazy lately, but let's go. <clears throat> Mind you, I think this game is based somewhere around um, suicide, maybe. As you can see, it says, if you feel that you're at risk of suicide or self-harm, please seek medical slash or professional advisement, treatment, and slash or support from experts in the field of suicide and self-harm prevention. If you need immediate assistance, please contact a local hotline or hospital. If you notice someone around you who appears to be struggling, try talking to them. One brave step can save lives. U US 98 suicide and crisis line line, tail 98 Europe. You know, there's the, the uh, link. International Research for Local Crisis Support Lines. I don't have help. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I appreciate, you know, them, I don't want to say making a game based on suicide, but like, you know, making it known that there's a lot of people out here struggling and that if somebody needs help, allow them to get that help, go talk to them, go be with them, support them in any way you can, I think. This is a topic that a lot of people don't talk about. And um, also, I really feel like it's really not talked about amongst men. Because, you know, men are taught to be so strong in the household and not to express emotions. So when they get, you know, into adulthood, it's harder for them to talk about those types of issues. But uh, we're going to get into it, man. I, I just had to, you know... Say a little something about that. It's not the easiest topic to talk about, but somebody, you know, I think had to touch on it just a little bit. Seeking a connection with others is a sign of weakness. It's running away. Mm. The strongest animals don't form groups. They act alone and need only themselves to survive. Those who betray themselves to fit into a group are pathetic. There's no beauty in living like that. I want to be strong on my own, without a group. If there were only someone who would understand that to adult me, Dang, this game is deep, y'all. Oh, uh, is that a, a barrier? A little thing with candles? Wait, is we playing as the girl who committed, you know, the act in adulthood? Bro, that's the game.
This model. Is it this building? Alright. Thief. Welcome to the city of no hope. What's this right here? No plans to rebuild kits and tact fail a second time. Plans to rebuild kits that have suffered yet another major major setback as instability caused by the COVID-19 pandemic has reduced interest for foreign investors. Previous plans to jump start the town failed to materialize on to the monetary instability caused by the 2008 global financial crisis, which forced the plan to involve Japanese corporations on financial institutions to, re to be reconsidered. Two attempts to rebuild two failures due to unfortunate external circumstances, Ketten Stat has struggled to bounce back with increased unemployment. The city council is considering ways to revitalize the economy by joining skilled experts to the area, but as of yet, no effective measures have been implemented. Everyone's losing their futures, and so all adults are a slave to the system. Woo! This game is deep. She said, people are losing their futures. Adults are a slave to a system. That's crazy. Right over here. What's over here? 4,267. Down five, six, four, two, thirteen. Plenty of kids that saved. The Plenty of kids that as an overview. Ken Stat did it. A town with a long history as a thriving border stronghold. In recent years, those in the 20s have been leaving it in mass, causing concern. The aim of this wide scale project is to rebuild Ken Stat and restore to its former glory with the help of Chinese investment firms. The theme is re revitalization. The abandoned properties developed by Japanese corporations in 2008 have been a problem, but by repurposing them, we can cut costs substantially and better realize our vision for a new kit instead. Wow. So this place didn't always suck. Our parents dreamed of this? Wait, I just came out that room. So, unless I'm missing something to interact with, oh, the door's open. That's OD. Where are you, Maya? No, I'm scared and nervous. It's a baby doll. Yeah, flowers. No exit. I'm trapped. I've always been trapped. Oh, here's the uh, building, the villa. Is there anything else I can read over here? <clears throat> Information saved, fire saved. September 28, 2021. Notice of professional meeting to all villa residents. We have received many inquiries about the management of this building after recent news. We would therefore like to hold a meeting to explain our policies more formally. formally. We hope you can find the time to attend. Is that a person? Maya? The artwork on this wall is, um, the repaint it all. The artwork on this wall is is hard. I mean, skeleton over here. All right. The artwork is crazy in this game. It's a lot of pain. Oh, I'm gonna leave this down here. About graffiti artist CB. 
for a graffiti artist, spray paint, and blank wall are all you need in Kevin's stat. The walls of a particular apartment building are the canvases for several artists with a new piece showing up every day. Social media star CB features her work here, given her passion for flowers. It's only fitting that her name is CB, which is short for Cherry Blossom. CB's art continues to captivate the hearts of the young, so we reached out to her for her comment, keeping her eye fixed on her new piece. She had this to say. All I'm doing is showing what these girls feel on the inside, but can't show on the outside. If any of them connect with the girl in the art, it's probably because they're experiencing the same thing. CB added that the flowers she depicts on the young girls she paints bloom out the scars they bear. The flowers represent the girls overcoming past traumas, or at least their desire to do so. Everyone can see how talented she is. I couldn't be more different. Did Maya do this? CB. Cherry Blossom. That's Maya's signature. She's... Amazing. Amazing. That's it? This city is a blank canvas. Begging for us to paint it with our hopes and dreams. I want to show the hidden side of girls. They're impulses, their urges. What are you hiding inside? Don't worry about what people think. Be proud. Oh, this game is tough. This game is tough. <sighs> How could I ever be proud of myself? Mm. How could I ever be proud of myself? That's crazy. So wait, am I missing something? I can't interact with that. I wonder if I can go back out through the door. Unless I miss something to interact with. Which I didn't. I read this, didn't I? Yeah, I read this. I must be able to go back. This art is graphic. Who's there? I just kind of get some rest now. Didn't mean to scare you or anything. <sighs> That's a relief. What's with this place? Why all the sticky notes? This must be like a wall of like bullying, child abuse, slash neglect, in Kenistat. A recent statistical survey has shown the rate of child abuse in Kenistat last year was nearly double that of the average in other developed nations in Europe. The reason of economic strife is that the resulting poverty are thought to be the cause. <sighs> My mom loved me. This is old. This is crazy. Antidepressant. 
antidepressants. I've taken enough medication. Damn. Look at all that medication on the table, yo. This game was very well done for as short as it is. What uh cockroaches? Uh, 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 this is all your fault! Bad things happen because of you! you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, they didn't show it. Good. Mom. This is so sad, bro. Like, bro, I'm gonna cry, yo. Like, this is so sad. Just came out of thin air. It's in a famous suicide spot. Teenage suicides can to an infamous building. A rundown apartment complex in Kansas has become known for its suicides, with teenage girls from jumping from its roof practically every year. Despite repeat events, the building abandoned ever since the development as management company declared bankruptcy remains easily accessible. The young and unemployed are not deterred by the building's grim reputation. Excuse me, though, with many continuing to enter it and young graffiti artists using it for their work. Meanwhile, local resident security concerns continue to grow. Please, not Maya, too. She has been acting weird lately. Cherry blossoms bloom within the grasp of death. With most flowers, the rot sets in, then they fall. That's the price of new life. Not cherry blossoms, though. They bloom beautiful, they fall beautiful. That's how I want my life to be. Why is she not replying? Come on! I have to find her. I mean, well, I hope we find her before it's too late. I read this, didn't I? 
We go this way. It's a door. Please don't tell me we gotta go back the other way. That's why I'm missing something in here. Which I don't think so. There's a building in the middle of nowhere. We can look outside. You're lying. We have to go back this way. The monster. It's gone, right? Where is the studio? Oh, the famous suicide spot. Thank you for tuning in, man. I appreciate all the support. Don't go that way. Too much swimming. They gotta be down the hole. Guys to be, bro. It's over there. Social media report say, inside the fog of social media, solitude and anxiety in teenagers. All of the teenagers interviewed said they were ashamed of the Rizik selfies they posted online. They also claimed they experienced anxiety over not getting any likes on such photos. What all of the kids had in common was extremely low self-esteem. The greater their anxiety and the lower their confidence, the more pronounced their reaction were to a positive attention. The sense of fulfillment they experience after getting on life online is difficult for those, for adults to comprehend. Furthermore, even when they acknowledge that teenagers still cannot view their actions positively and quickly reverted to despair, seeking more attention to fill the void. Teenagers who are not yet psychologically mature run the risk of experiencing this toxic quest for validation. That's the room I just came out of, isn't it? Yeah. We can't go that way. So oh, creepy. Maya. I hope you're all right. I brought that bro was gonna pop right back up. By the way, thought any more about college. I can't do it. You don't have to decide right away. So, once you're at college, are you not coming back here? No way, I'll come back occasionally. My parents would give me shit if I didn't come home for breaks. But yeah, I just kind of more thought, okay? I told you I can't go, it's not for me. Studying isn't my thing. I told you I would help. It's fine, I can't do anything. I don't know what, what I'd do if I got in. That's not true, you're way too hard on yourself. Be proud of who you are. Hey, what about those drawings you showed me? You could audit our art class. It could lead to a job. I'm not Maya, okay? Emily doesn't get it. Gotcha. So he don't really like this place. I get it. People in this town say graffiti as nothing but trashy doodles. And my classmates talk about me. Might not be a bad idea to leave town, actually. The great thing about graffiti is the world's your canvas. And as long as I'm with you, 
I can have fun anywhere. There's no way out. Maya, are you here? Is this your studio? Are these Maya's sketches? These aren't even finished. And they look this good. They seem happy. A new life. So full of life. Maya? Why won't she reply? Where are you? Am I going crazy? Who did Maya have in mind? Did you post this too? <sighs> Even more followers. I lost followers again. Some new followers here. I need to upload stuff like this to get as many likes as Maya. Sexy! Hey. <laughs> Loving it! Stop with Stop. the boring photos already. No sexy stuff, no followers. Wow. You hate your followers. Congrats on reaching your follower goal. Oh. Come on. We want sexy stop. pics already. Just stop. Please. This is so crazy. Like. I'm sorry. You have your own situation to deal with. I was out of line. I was thinking selfishly. I'm so sorry. Uh, no, I, I shouldn't have gotten mad like that. Thanks, Anita. I guess I haven't accepted Maya's death yet. Huh? Why did she jump from the villa? Why did she have to die? Maya's... dead? Wait... Maya's really dead? Uh, how... how could I forget that? Who's this? Find it. Who?
That's, That's crazy. crazy. <laughs> I'm sure she was gonna get you regardless. Is this a dream? I don't know what I'm gonna do. No, this is not how the game ended. You're lying. You're lying. You're lying. You're lying. You're lying. You're lying. Wow. If you feel that you're at risk of suicide or suffering, please seek medical or such professional advice, treatment, such and or support from from experts in the field of suicide and self-harm prevention. If you need immediate assistance, please contact a local hotline or hospital. If you know there's someone around you who will Appears to be strong. Try talking, talking to them. One brave step can save lives. Huh? Oh, I was about to say, I know you're lying, bro. I know that's not how the game is. Am I back at the villa? But why didn't I die? I'm so confused, bro. I'm not lost.
it's locked. I didn't think this game was longer than like 30 minutes given how small it was. It's taking me back in all the rooms I was just in. Wait, it's back on? How could somebody do this? Death mask. So unfortunate. Some people really have nothing better to do. Wait. I bet it was these guys. This is just like before. Deja vu. Good to me, but you're leaving me behind. Did Maya really not say anything? Like, at all? So, what'd you think of the book? The author killed themselves. They were young. Something beautiful from something tragic. It's kind of enchanting, isn't it? I wonder what they were thinking right before they died. Anyway, I didn't think you'd share your thoughts in a letter. You really are shy, aren't you? Actually, kind of like that, though. You write in a really flowery and passionate way. I wonder what they were thinking right before they died. I can't wait to read more. Anyway, I didn't think you'd share your thoughts in a letter. You really are shy, aren't you? Actually, oh, kind of like that. Okay. Though. Letters. You write in a really flowery and passionate way. If you 
want food. Do what I say. The reunification of death in Japanese culture. In Japanese culture, there is no moment of being sacrificed by harakiri, killing oneself by slicing one's stomach, being a prime example. The idea was that by taking your own life, you symbolically purge the world of your transgressions and purify yourself. This concept can be confused into many Westerns, with young people incorrectly assuming Japanese yearn for a beautiful way to die. Modern Japanese people, however, do not view suicide in such a positive light anymore. In a life they value is not the biological variety, but rather a social one with death needed to protect that life. Wonder what those guys are talking about. Fortune telling? A lot of people are getting into that. Huh. You don't believe in that stuff? Well, I think there's something real about it. My great grandmother was a fortune teller. I hear people here used to treat her like some sort of prophet. But they all eventually turned on my great-grandmother. Guess you can predict other people's futures, but not your own. <clears throat> believe in the witch of Kenistat. Believe in witch of Kenistat. Those who believe in the witch of Kenistat share many practices with modern Wiccans, such as praying for a bountiful harvest and a goddess of worship. What sets the practice apart is a slightly blend of both Western and Eastern new customs. As far as what led to mixing of customs, there is one rather great creative theory. During the joint efforts of Japanese and German entrepreneurs and laborers in the 1930s to foster economic growth and prosperity, there was an exchange in cultural belief and rise, rise to belief in witches. Tarot cards. <laughs> no point predicting my future. Nothing here. Hate field notebook. This is all your fault. Everything. You're a heartless. Ooh. You B word. Stole my only friend. My place in this for all of it. And you don't even care. I'm invisible to you. I effing hate you. You're not talented. You're not special. You can. You call those S stains art. You came out of nowhere and ruined everything. F off. 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 Get the F out of my life. You piece of S freak. That's. How can you be so happy? University Orientation. Dutch Land Medical University School of Medicine Orientation. During coming freshman, welcome to Dutch Land Medical University. Founded in 1709. <coughs> DMU is one of the Europe's oldest and most revered institutions. It's state-of-the-art research facilities eagerly await your arrival. This is for the college Amelie wants to go to. So 
shocking me yet. We can find you something cute. But I'm not a fan of crowds. And nothing was cute on me anyways. Stop talking like that. You're way too hard on yourself. You got the looks. You just need to find the right outfit. Too hard on myself, huh? Amelie's the only one who thinks that. <sighs> College prep diary, December 2020 to May 2021. December 23rd, 2020. I haven't been able to study since my brother came back for Christmas break. He's nice and he doesn't interrupt my studies or anything, but I can't stand him staring at me. I know he was probably just messing with me back then, but I've been scared of him ever since. It's made me hate any guys looking at me. I can't believe other girls walk around school in town showing so much skin. February 21st, 2021. I think I'm finally finding my study groove. My test scores are really good. I'm worried about how much my parents are fighting recently. No. They were yelling at each other again today. I asked mom why, but she wouldn't say. May 11, 2021. This is it, test day tomorrow. Mom told me I should be proud of myself since I worked so hard, so I'm feeling great. She's not my real mom, but I know she loves me and I love her. Mom, I'm gonna ace this test tomorrow for both me and dad. I think it went from like, I hate you to like, This is crazy how they did this though. October 17, 2020. I'm finally focused on my studies, so I think I might pull an all-nighter. It won't be good for my skin. I can just hear people call me a troll and a nerd, but I don't care. I have to make it to college in the city. Mom and dad are counting on me to do well. I'll make them proud by getting to my first choice. All right, time to hit the books till morning. Remember my 2020 dad? Dad was talking today about how there was a plan to rebuild the town. They were gonna use a bunch of funding from China to do, turn the town into something better. But everything got canceled due to COVID. Sure, it would have been nice if it had gone through, but I just couldn't see it happen. Even if things had worked out, not in this place, it, has been, it hasn't been special since I was little. There's nothing to do with the buildings are ancient, it's a dome. My future isn't here, it's in the city where college life is waiting for me. Everything's riding on my entrance examination. I have to get out before my brothers come back. I got some materials for my first choice in the mail today. I'm going to be a college freshman. I'm so, so happy. I still can't believe it. Mom and dad, I'm going to study my so off and be the best daughter ever. Thank you so much for everything. Mom and dad are yelling at each other. They're talking about bankruptcy. Wasn't everything supposed to work out even without that rebuilding plan? So this means they're out of money, right? Does this mean I can't go to college? All that hard work was for nothing? No way, don't leave me. Mom, I can't stay here. I can't be stuck here with my brother. September 23rd, 21. Mom just left. She told me to get out of the way. I have to get out of here. I don't want to disappear, but where would I go? This is all a bad dream. This is all a bad dream. This is all a bad dream. Amelie hated the way her brother looked at her. I bet she wants to leave to get away from all that. News article. On suicides. At around 10 a.m. on the 24th, a local resident reported seeking an 18 year old female high school student falling from the roof at Kenny's that apartment building. The girl was rushed to the hospital, but was pronounced dead two hours later. According to the school staff, the girl was distraught over not being able to attend college due to troubles at home. No note on diary was found, but police still believe her death may be a suicide. Homily's not like this, though. Right? I don't know what else, right?
open. Unless I'm missing something, bro, I don't know. Gotta go through the green door. And we can't go back that way, so I'm assuming. Oh. Dumb. Go away. Oh, 
the transitions. I'm not happy with that. She keep passing out. Back that way, can I? It won't open. Here we go, Maya's diary. This is what she must have been talking about. I haven't really been in a good mood since this morning. I tried to lose myself in my graffiti, but I wasn't feeling it. Maybe it's because mom and I argued this morning. Probably not. We've clashed before. I've known for a long time we value different things. Is it because my classmates teased me? I doubt it. They don't know me. They're just taking their issues out on someone else. Some, someone. It got to be because I lost that special person and the hope he gave me, right? Why do I feel like this? I've never liked, I've never felt like this before. That had to be what she meant, right? The diary. This guy looks familiar. <clears throat> They're hurt. Where are you going? Yeah, that's right. Amelie. <laughs> Find it. Hmm? What's that? Oh, you like what you see? Come closer then. Wait a sec. You two are from my class. Those glasses look good on you. Sorry, she's so cute. I couldn't help myself. That's me. Feel free to That's stop by me. anytime. You're always welcome. <laughs> Maya only ever cared about Amelie. She didn't see me. I was invisible to her. Why do I feel like the game just changed? The library 
So, I'm back at school. There's no beauty in any of this. Cry, baby. Freeze. Oh, oh, sorry. I was just thinking about something. I borrowed that book you wanted. I finished it, so it's all yours. I wrote my impressions in a letter. Read it when you get home, Kay. Where was it? That book. Which cursed in peace progress. Can't stand the town cursed by a witch. Malicious magic to blame for city slum. Can't stand to to see a rapid decline in its population. The birth rate is at a mere 0 0.7, less than half of a German nation average 1.6. Miscarriages are also at 31%, more than double the average 15%. The economy is in shambles, and the once booming industrial city is built to revitalize itself twice. The number of researchers studying the occult and point to a witch is the cause of the economic downturn in Kettenstad. The witch was a Japanese woman who used her clairvoyance to influence economic development in the town in the 1930s. Researchers believe she was hunted down and killed before her death. She is believed to have placed a curse on the town, stymieing its growth. So, it is a curse. But why me? Why do I have to be cursed like this? Find what in a place like this? Find, bro, it's the book. It has to be the book. It's not the book, but look at that. Sapiens. The cover was blue, if I'm not mistaken. Or no. The witch hunt. The witch hunt in Kenistat. In 1930s Germany, the town of Kenistat attracted wealthy entrepreneurs and enjoyed a period of economic prosperity. Behind that success, though, was supposed to be a Japanese woman who used her clairvoyance and mystic powers to guide the entrepreneurs. She would come to be known as the Witch of the Far East and would be greatly respected by the German people. However, in 1947, the entrepreneurs suffered great losses. A large fire spread throughout their industrial parks, losing them, losing them, the majority of their factories. The Witch of the Far East, who was hospitalized, jumped off the roof of the hospital and killed herself. The witch had been dying of an unknown illness, and many believe the fires pushed her over the edge. Some citizens, however, claimed that a witch hunt was to blame. They argued the witch's rise to prominence and entered the mayor's party who used the chaos from the fires as a cover for murder. There is no su evidence to support this claim, and many now view it as a mere conspiracy theory, but the mayor's party did manage to regain influence in the town after the witch's death. Since then, the citizens have started to believe any struck of bad luck as a result of the witch's curse. A witch's curse? Is that why I saw what I did before? I gotta be missing something in here. Looks I'm like there's space for a book here. Wait, I think I know these. Uh. Flashback. <sighs> no way. Wait, I still wait. The book is over here. I promise you it's over here. Oh, the door opened. Of course the door opened after you see the book you need.
already been there. It's like that other school. Why does this always happen? I've never seen Maya like that before. Hey, no cap. No, 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 no not no, saying don't, don't push, push the, the issue, issue, but like, like you gotta, gotta, I would say, constantly check, check up on your peoples, man. You never know what somebody going through. That's not true. Right here. Maya's locker. No, it's not here. It wasn't here before either. Is it in my locker? You gotta check the locker. My locker. Why is it locked? Is there something I don't want to see? Locker code. Wait. Wait. Locker code. What what would the locker code be? What would the locker code be? Hold on. I don't know. I didn't see a code the whole game. It's what? One, two, three, four digits? I'm not, I'm not sure, sure bro. Like, like y'all gotta right, say, I don't see, see anything. I know what's inside, and I can't look away. Here it is. What's this letter? Was it inside the book? Remember when I said I wanted to live like a cherry blossom? To be beautiful and dignified for a fleeting moment, simply by letting go of life. Daring to bloom, knowing it won't last. And so falling in vivid color. I wish I could live like that. I want to experience true beauty. If only for a moment. I met someone who made me feel different. He showed me a whole new world, gave me hope. I honestly thought he could help me find a new me. I felt it with all my heart. But people didn't understand us. 
didn't want that from us. In the end, they took my hope from me. They took him away. People... People who can't achieve beauty seek comfort in others. They fear anyone different. Hate them. Try to tear them down. I can't take much more of this. I wish you and I had... I wish you and I could run away together, Amelie. Just me and you. Maya... She was asking Amelie for help. But I just... Uh. Maya, you have everything. You're way more talented than me. So why? Why take Amelie from me, who acted like I wasn't even there? Amelie is my friend. She's mine! Uh, I only wanted to take her down a bit. She she was taking Amelie away from me. She wouldn't pay attention to me. How was I supposed to know she'd actually kill herself? Can't grab the book. book. Of course. Nice. Can't grab the book. I hope we don't gotta go back. It's only your fault. Oh, my God. 
Was I supposed to take the lead? I swear to God, I was supposed to take the lead. Oh, it's beautiful. Maya, I finally get it. I know what you wanted me to find. Anita, what's up? I'm so sorry, Amelie. Maya died because I killed her. What are you talking about? You and Maya wrote letters to each other, right? Yeah, but then Maya jumped off the villa roof. Well, there was supposed to be one in the last book you had, too. What? That letter. That letter was a message for you. Well, why are you telling me this, Anita? I was jealous of Maya. I was afraid she'd take you away from me. <laughs> My mom was right. I should never have been born. Whoa, wait, wait, Anita, calm down. She better, better not, not do it. Do it. Is that the end of the game? I promise you, if that's not the end of the game, I'm about to get sorted. Because I just did all of that. I think that's the end of the game. What? You ready to leave? She let me leave? I jumped off the building. I don't think Maya wanted her to die. I just think Maya wanted her to understand. I know you wanted, she wanted Amelie to help her. Oh, Lord. Huh? Whoa. Whoa. Even if I die, this doesn't end. How many times do I have to go through this? I 
gorilla. <laughs> Couldn't help but think of the girl who jumped her death last year. Actually, a lot of girls killed themselves here. All teams supposedly. Now the place is a famous spot for people to kill themselves. Looking down the road, I can see how high and high was. The thought of a light being seen to me flying made me go a little queasy. Were they not scared? What was going through their heads? Are they jumping away from something? our living room. No, no, I'm sorry. I think a diary right there. Diary of a single mother, single mother, December 2011. 2011. December 29, 2011. 2011. I finally lost touch with him. I've never seen him again. I thought I found my happily ever after. But it was all a dream. However, I haven't lost in everything. I still have my children, my cute little angels who lighten up my life. Is that another one in here? Pizza. Why won't you listen to a damn thing I say? Stay straight. Another diary. Diary single mother, February 2012. My new man showed up to my place today with pizza. Children definitely needed a father, but they still won't take to him. He looked annoyed when he left. I hope he doesn't hate me. My, my February 22nd, 2012, my daughter drew a picture of our family. We're smiling and holding hands. I wish she would have drawn him as well. Maybe she doesn't realize he might join our family. She was slower than the other kids her age. I'm sure she'll catch up and pass them soon enough. I know how to raise a child. I'm a good mother. I'm nothing like that heartless bitch who raised me. Well, excuse my language, y'all, man. I won't fill my children with hate and fear. Let me make sure there ain't nothing else in here that I need to interact with. All right. Um. 
Every single, single mother. mother. March to March April, April 2012. 2012. March 7th, 2012. 2012. He showed up again with a smile on his face and a pizza in his hands from the new place he was raving about. My daughter hated the pizza, though she's extremely picky. I know she probably... I should probably, I should probably teach, her teach her to eat things she doesn't like. like. I know it was forced to eat. I know I was forced to eat things I hated when I was a kid, but I guess it has to be done. March 22nd, 2012, the kids finally blew up in front of him today. He was exhausted from work and said he just wanted to relax. He makes it feel so good, but I can't do the same for him. Maybe I'm not strict enough with him. We need him for a happy life. I need them to realize that. I know it's probably a little harsh, but maybe if they don't see the light for a while, they'll finally see the light in him. April 12th, 2012. <laughs> He told, he told me about, me about the banging, banging on the closet, closet door. door. It was making it hard for him to unwind. If they would just be quiet for a little bit, everything would be fine. What's wrong with them? He doesn't visit us as much as he used to. If I don't figure something out, I may never see him again. Am I a little kid? I got it. Oh, we is. We playing as a little kid. We got to be. Three. Oh, down here? I'm giving up my life for you! Whoa. This is trifling. May 2nd, 2012. Everything seemed to be going well now that we've been going out on dates. He was worried about my kids, so he bought them a bunch of books and toys. That should be enough to keep them occupied, right? I've been going out so much lately that I've left the place in a bit of a mess. I should clean it, but by the time I get back, I have no energy. May 25th, 2012. I got contacted by the Child Welfare Center. I guess some nosy bitch or asshole. Excuse my language again, man. My bad, y'all. And my building reported hearing a child crying at night in my place. The F do they know? He hasn't called me much lately. Am I destined to be alone? Everyone else is out and going like, why am I working my A off raising kids? Why am I the effing bad guy? July 15th, 2020, if I had a hat choice, maybe I'd be playing in my summer vacation with my friends right now. Nothing matters anymore. I'm just crawling through life. I know what's going on in the closet, but I can't look. I just want to be happy. What's wrong with that? I'm done. This is nasty work. Stop. Miss Krista for a nurse. We have reached out to you over but have yet to receive a response. You take this thing, and then you have an answer. You have to remedy this issue. You have a violation of the German Civil War Article 6 of the Section 2. According to the federal court, has instructed us to take your children. Should you have any objection to this, please call us as soon as possible. News article on child death by neglect. A boy found dead in refrigerator. Mother arrested August 4, 2012. A boy was found dead today in a refrigerator at the home of his 41 year old mother, Person A, who was arrested by local authorities for hiding the body. Whoa. Person A claims to have locked her son in the closet for more than a day to punish him. When she noticed he wasn't moving the next morning, she hid his lifeless body in the refrigerator. Investigators are conducting an autopsy to determine the cause of death. According to the investigation, a person A's daughter ran into a neighbor, neighbor's house to call the police and report her mother for a neglect. When detectives arrived at the house, they discovered her brother's body in the refrigerator and arrested the mother after she confessed to her crime. Uh, you just me again! You can just stay in there! Stay in there. Stuff like that, and it goes to infection into a dog. Please don't leave me. You shouldn't be. Please don't leave me. 
You shouldn't be having kids. I, I, I'm a curse. You always you. said you'd be better off without me. You're not my daughter. Don't You're burning. I always felt like a curse for my mother. Some people just aren't meant to, you know, have them. My kids, if you know, they're not. You're wrong, mom. Because the stuff. I am that they your have. daughter. So and I think just it's like you. Help get help. I'm cursed. Damn, that's so sad, bro. Why am I seeing this room here in the villa? I tried so hard to forget this place. Okay. That's not even my fault. I couldn't do nothing. I know you're lying, bro. I can't even do nothing right there. I just walked through the door. I'm sorry, Mom! What am I supposed to do? Is there a door right there? Oh, my God.
Sai, 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 sai. This should have had. That is. This should have
What's up with y'all, man? So I got, I got, I got, I got, I got, I got what you got in inventory? I have the locker, the suitcase, the top. There's three of them. There should be just one more.
I think I need to be way too hard on this. I'm trying to see what door this is. I can't remember. I got the locker. locker. I got the chest. chest. I mean, on the uh, the chest, chest part, part, the suitcase. suitcase. I think it's I think four, it's four of them. What's this one? That's the room with all the stuff in it. Okay, bro. I'm just having to find it.
too hard on yourself. I'm sorry! I'm so sorry!
not trying to hunt that. See if the door would have opened. through this one. Mine's already saved free. I've been really absorbed in my work lately. I decided to paint the girls who jump off the villa roof. I like to think they left this place for something better. I think I might finally be free of my despair because I've never felt this inspired. I want to put every last bit of myself into this piece. Public artist found dead cause I know. Approximately 1 p.m. on the 12th, popular graffiti artist C.B. Maya Ako Hindenburg was found collapsed on the grounds of the apartment building of a cat and scat. She was pronounced dead at the hospital. The death of the 18 year old girl comes as a shock to not only the local community members but also to those who were familiar with her work. Authorities believe the cause of them may be suicide, but given her popularity and the lack of warning signs to her peers, they have not ruled out foul play and proceeding with a full scale investigation. Wait. She killed herself half a year ago? 
And that means... I've been here this whole time? What'll it take for you to forgive me? Please, end this. Just let me die. <laughs> Is this... me? When did she draw this? I want to show the hidden side of girls. Their impulses. Their urges. What are you hiding inside? Don't worry about what people think. Be proud. So... She did notice me. I was so happy when my mom liked the first picture I drew. I could have had a different life, too. I guess someone finally did love me. You actually noticed me. I never thought you would. Emily, what should I do? Anita, what's up? Great game. Great game. I'm, I'm sorry, Amelie. I'm such a piece of shit. I had no idea she'd do that. What are you talking about? Did something happen? I thought I was invisible. That I didn't matter. No matter what anyone said, I didn't listen. Anita? But you... And Maya, both of you did see me. I should have figured that out sooner. Anita, wait. Where are you right now? Thank you, Homily. You were always there for me. I'm... I'm going to go apologize to Maya now. Wait, Anita! Calm down. Just listen to me. I just... Beautiful. 
I am here for you, Anita. Seeking a connection with others is a sign of weakness. It's running away. The strongest animals don't form groups. They act alone and need only themselves to survive. Those who betray themselves to fit into a group are pathetic. There's no beauty in living like that. But I don't really mind. I just want someone to understand me. For those I love, and for those who love me, I want to keep moving forward and never look back to 18-year-old me. More title, Akimoto. Scenario, Kiichi Kano. Level design director Ricky Mayatani, Hex Drive Inc. Escape game director Tizia Namba, Hex Drive Inc. Pencil Drive Inc. Cutscene director Jane Morita, student. I'm sorry if I'm mispronouncing any of these. Akira Yamiaka, creature design slash other words on Michelle Ito. Moving day. It feels Kinda scary leaving my hometown, but I'll be fine. I have my best friend with me. Wow. That's a beautiful picture. Okay. Wow, y'all. And that is the end of the game. Once again, we're going to read this last time. If you feel that you're at risk of suicide or self-harm, please seek medical and such other professional advising, advice, treatment, and slash or support from a person in the field of suicide and self-harm prevention. If you need immediate assistance, please contact a local hotline or hospital. If you know someone around you who appears to be struggling, try to talk out to them. One brain step can save lives. Let me see what you can do to chapter chapter three. That was a beautiful game. That was a beautiful game. I I, I can't stress enough the that if you need to talk to someone, you should. You 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 gotta talk to somebody. I don't know. This game was very beautifully done. I love to give a child to Hex of Drive Inc. and the rest of the LLCs. Um, this game hit home. I'm not going to lie to you. Like, this game hit home, not just for me, but for people that I know who've, you know, who've had crazy types of thoughts and just felt like nobody saw them, nobody was there for them. Um, It's not the it's easiest not the trying to talk to anybody, to but <clears throat> if you ever feel like you need to talk to someone, no matter who it is, you know, if you can get a hold of somebody, get a hold of them. This the just any warning could could change the course of somebody's life forever for the better. That was my first that time playing any type of Silent Hill game. game. 
I gotta go back and play the other ones now. Um, I can't stress it enough. It was just a great game. The the flashbacks, the the cutscenes. It just it left a really strong message. It left a very strong message. I wanna say. I appreciate y'all. Even if I don't know y'all in person, I appreciate y'all <laughs> for watching. Watching. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that. Uh, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share. I will see y'all on the next video. I love y'all. Take care. Peace.